Today, I'm going to demonstrate how to do a VBNG version upgrade. This is the BNG I'm going to do upgrade on. Uh, first, let's check the BNG running state. Uh, all the BNG processes are running in green running state. Everything is fine. <coughs> so, and uh, you can go to ConfD, CLI, and then we can show uh, sysinfo and it will display the current version is ATM means Atom processor uh, B21 P1 version so we want to upgrade this to a newer version so what we do is we exit comedy we go back to the host uh, here um, the, a couple things we need to do first I think before we do upgrade uh, we definitely want to back up the current configuration file so so that we can restore the configuration after the upgrade is complete as uh, to back up the configuration file uh, conf d cli and then we just uh, in, get into config mode and then we say save and let's save under root and um, let's say uh, config uh, backup txt and this is a complete so we just exit this and then we exit back to the host. Let's see. And uh, we should see the backup uh, file is here. Now we have the configuration file backing up. Now we uh, we need to get the version, right? So now we just um, let's run our NetElastic download script. And uh, let's get the latest um, Atom version. The latest Atom version is this option. Currently we are on um q1 uh, build 28 so let's get the latest version this will take um a few minutes it shouldn't take that long depends on your uh, connection speed all right now we have the version and uh, you can see uh, this version is here. This is the version we are going to upgrade to. Uh, so one thing I want to make clear to upgrade we need to first copy this file to a designated place. So we do a copy this version to USR local service um, version. Uh, we just need to copy it to that to this particular location. The the version you're going to upgrade to, you copy to this location and then just copy. Uh, we back up the configuration, we already got the version, and so now we can do a upgrade. To do upgrade, we start, we launch the VNF manager shell. It's just VNF, type VNF SH. And here you have two options. One is you can type Y to skip uh, or type N to set it up. The first time, um, if you haven't done an upgrade, you should Use, uh, you should have N to set it up. Uh, actually, most of these options here, you can just hit enter because it doesn't apply. One thing I wanted to make sure is this one, the SH root password. You do want to make sure type in the password that matches the root, the host root password. So here, uh, my root password is net elastic. So I just type that in and then I just skip these. And now, essentially, we set up the VNF uh, manager shell uh, through which we're going to do the upgrade. So uh, to, to show here, you can see a few commands here. The first one is the show instance. This command shows you the current installed version. You can see this is the current installed version. And uh, the current state finished means it's installed already. Uh, so now we are going to uh, do an upgrade. So to do upgrade, we run a command called setup local. Uh, setup a local version. And uh, remember, we uh, copy the newer the new version to the designated directory. And once the uh, the version uh, package is in the directory, it will list up here. So you see here we only have a one version. So we just choose by the index number one, and, uh, and it will ask to see if we want to set up all instances. So we answer yes, and uh, now we are uh, essentially done.
and now the VNF manager is doing the uh, version upgrade in the background. So now let's take a look at you know, what state it is in. So to show what is what the upgrade status is in, we just use the command show um, instances, and you can see uh, it's already finished. Uh, currently is on B28 and the current state is finished so we can now we are done with this so we can just exit back to the host and now we can tap flex BNG and see if the processes are running so the processes are running and everything seems to be fine now we can go to go back to conf D let's take a look at the, um, the system info so let's do show um, sys Info and now you can see it's upgraded to version B28. Mm -hmm.